Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a significant development this week, China revealed its latest addition to its military arsenal, the Z-21 attack helicopter. Images shared on Chinese social media platforms on March 24, 2024, showcased the Z-21 during its flight tests, marking a milestone in China's efforts to bolster its aerial capabilities. This new helicopter, believed to be derived from the Z-20 model, represents a significant leap forward for the People's Liberation Army, PLA, in terms of combat readiness and technological advancement. The Z-21 bears a striking resemblance to the iconic AH-64 Apache attack helicopter, an American-made aircraft renowned for its combat prowess. This similarity in design underscores China's intention to develop a formidable aircraft capable of rivaling its Western counterparts. However, while drawing inspiration from the AH-64 Apache, the Z-21 also retains design elements from its predecessor, the Z-20, itself inspired by the American Black Hawk helicopter. One of the most notable features of the Z-21 is its attack-optimized configuration, which includes a sleeker silhouette designed for combat operations. While specific details regarding its weaponry and defensive systems are yet to be confirmed, initial observations suggest enhancements aimed at improving battlefield survivability. These enhancements include upgraded self-defense systems and a design tailored to reduce the helicopter's infrared signature, thereby minimizing its vulnerability to heat-seeking missiles. Despite the absence of a chin-mounted gun in the current images, it is anticipated that the Z-21 will incorporate this feature as a standard addition, further augmenting its firepower and combat capabilities. The Z-21 shares several characteristics with the American UH-64, reflecting a convergence in the design concepts of attack and utility helicopters. Both aircraft boast robust power plants and advanced cockpit configurations aimed at maximizing pilot visibility and operational efficiency. Additionally, they feature protruding fairings and strategically placed chain guns, underscoring their shared emphasis on firepower and combat versatility. Military experts anticipate that the Z-21 will play a crucial role in potential conflicts involving Taiwan or India, thanks to its ability to operate effectively in high-altitude environments. This capability is particularly valuable for operations in mountainous terrain, where traditional aircraft may face challenges. By enhancing China's offensive capabilities in these regions, the Z-21 could potentially alter the dynamics of regional conflicts. The development of the Z-21 is the result of collaboration between various entities within the Chinese defense industry, including Harbin, Changha, and the 602nd Research Institute. This collaborative effort exemplifies China's integrated approach to military modernization, highlighting its commitment to enhancing its defense capabilities through technological innovation and strategic partnerships. With an expected service entry within the next two to three years, the Z-21 is poised to complement and potentially replace existing attack helicopter models in the Chinese arsenal, such as the Z-10. Its introduction underscores China's ongoing efforts to modernize and expand its armed forces, signaling its readiness to confront emerging security challenges in an increasingly volatile geopolitical landscape. In conclusion, the unveiling of the Z-21 represents a significant milestone for China's military aviation program, demonstrating the country's determination to assert itself as a formidable force on the global stage. As the Z-21 undergoes further testing and eventual deployment, it is likely to become a key asset in China's defense strategy, reshaping the dynamics of regional power projection and security. That's all for now. See you later.